Hello, I'm Frankie. And I'm Rachel. And welcome to the uh, second part now of our reaction um, little mini video series that we're doing. We're still new to this, we're still just experimenting a little. We got a few views on the first one, not yeah, that bad. Like Several. Like five or six or something like that. Not well, as of recording, I know, not bad. And even one like. Thank you very much, whoever liked that. <laughs> very nice, very nice. Um, you know, they're, they're, these are a little bit lackluster at the minute. I'm still lo looking into like background music that we can use, yeah. but I can't find anything at the moment. So that's why they they might feel a little shallow or like they're they're missing something. But uh, we're back, and uh, well, I was going to say we are fans of Doctor Who. We are. But we're not up to date on the series. In fact, I don't even remember what series we're on. We're on the one still with Peter Capaldi. Yeah. I think it might be the one before this one that we're on, or maybe two behind. But so we haven't, we're not really up to date. We haven't been watching that. It's not really high on the, my list, personally. I don't know about you, but I don't, I'm not too bothered. I do plan to watch it eventually. But it's just that... To me, Doctor Who ain't that, it hasn't been that good. It hasn't? Like... I remember loving the David Tennant era. Uh, I I don't remember not liking any episode of that. Not 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 liking any episode of that. I loved them all. They're all good. I loved it. Then David Tennant left. Pissed me off. I kind of understand, but you know, screw you. <laughs> He's like, I don't want to go. Fuck off. You did want to go, but uh, I was very skeptical with um. I forgot what his name is, but Matt. Isn't it? Matt, Matt Smith. Matt Smith. I was skeptical about him. At first, but he grew on me. I liked him. I did feel that he was a little bit too um, blatantly bit trying to be David Tennant's doctor yeah. a little bit, but he was still unique enough to stand on his own. But maybe that's why I liked him more as well. And then Peter Capaldi. I liked Peter Capaldi. I like. Oh, wait, before we jump to Peter Capaldi, Matt Smith's doctor, we liked him. We somewhat liked the series, but we felt that it just wasn't as good. Like no, the, they're, they're, like, at the start, <clears throat> I was still, like, in, I don't know, I was still, like, in the David Tennant bubble, you know, like, still thinking, yeah, it's going to be awesome, and then it just felt like every episode was, like, downhill, you mm. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. This, I guess it's the writing of it, just, it wasn't as good, it wasn't as interesting, and it, it's just, it just kept going, like, we would find ourselves, we were watching it. And before, where we would like look forward to every episode, like, oh, I can't wait. We just started being, eh. Eh. and Peter Capaldi, his doctor was really funny. We really liked him. But then it, it went even worse. Like yeah. the stories oh. were one of the ones I hate the most was that Christmas one. I think it yeah, was. Yeah, that was really bad. It was like superheroes or something. Like the like to dislike ratio of my Peter Capaldi's is like way more dislikes. Episode. To Matt, than Matt Smith's. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I agree. So that's why we kind of stopped watching Doctor Who because we weren't looking forward to it anymore. We didn't, we didn't like it, but we will continue it eventually because I like Doctor Who. I like the idea. It was my favourite ever TV show. Mm. Was. Now hearing about how the Doctor's going to be female now, so I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm not sexist, despite uh, popular opinion on anyone who does not Well, I'm like a woman, it. and I don't like it, so... Mm. It just doesn't feel right to me. I have read some stuff about uh, how you know, there could be the possibility of, uh, uh, of Time Lords being able to change genders during um, regeneration. They never... In, in the very old, old, old original ones, I, remember, I, was, I was reading an article that it was nowhere there. Like, nowhere was it canon in the story that that was a thing. Like, that was a thing that Time Lords could do. But something about, like, uh, a producer or something, I can't remember who it was, but he was questioned back in that time period-ish, where he said he, that he would be interested to explore something like that. But that never happened. And then, apparently, the earliest um, talk about, you know, a, a Time Lord being able, to, time, uh, being able to regenerate from a male to a woman was like 2011 or something like that I think it said in the article and it was in a, I think it was in a David Tennant episode I'm not too sure I can't remember but so so the seeds were put there but it still doesn't feel right to me no. it still doesn't feel right to me um I didn't like the master coming back as a girl I thought that was no, stupid I didn't like that. 
like I thought the woman played the master good, like she did sound like the master and stuff and acted like him, but it still didn't feel right to me. It's, and uh, so there was a lot of controversy on this. Also, I was looking up this woman. Um, oh, I forgot uh, who who uh, who plays her. Um, does it say in the description? Uh, I don't see it. But the the woman who plays her, the actress. Did you know she's in a Black Mirror episode? Was well, she? What yeah, one? I thought she looked familiar. She, it's the one where the couples can rewind their memories, like their times was and she, stuff. What, was she the wife? She was the wife oh. of that episode. But anyway, this trailer, look, as you can see at the moment of what we're recording, it has 12,000 likes and 6,500 dislikes. It's quite, a, quite a large dislike there. It's almost, it's, it's half, actually. It's more than half. Mm. A little over half. I think it's going to get higher. Probably. Now, why do people dislike it? Well, I don't know. Uh, we haven't watched this yet, but when I did click on this, when I heard about it the other day, it did play for one second, and I heard a split second of the music. Yeah. Let's just stop talking. Let's watch this, shall we? <coughs> so let's full screen this. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Alright, starting the video in three, two, one. You know I'm back. Like I never no, no, no. I never Oops. I feel glorious, glorious. Got a chance to start again. <sighs> what? What even was it? What? Yeah, right. Like, firstly, that fucking music. What was that? That was not Doctor Who. That was not Doctor Who at all. I just. Uh, what? What did we just watch? I do not even get it. I don't even understand it. Whoops. What even was that for a trailer? If I had to just give like one word description of what this entire trailer was, what we just watched, it would be what she said at the end of there. Whoops. Like, it's so short, I don't even know what to think about. I did not like that. Like, I, I was already had like a, a negative like impression that I don't like the doctor being a girl it doesn't uh, no it's not it's not right but then they play this and they put that horrible dubstep or something should we look at the comments and see what uh, a lot of people were saying yeah. okay <clears throat> let's scroll down let's look at the comments so you couldn't choose a better song Agreed. Yes. They couldn't have chosen a better song. But that was terrible. Doctor Who's been ruined. Some, some of them are a little bit melodramatic. I, but I do agree. Like Doctor Who just isn't good anymore. It's not the same. The thing is, that it's not been good the last few seasons. Since David Tennant left, it's only gone down. Did anyone else feel like they were watching a Disney Channel promo rather than a Doctor Who promo? I don't really know. I don't watch Disney Channel. I haven't seen it in years. So what else we got? Yeah, not the greatest music choice, but it looks beautiful. I disagree with that comment there. What looked beautiful about that? To me, I thought it looked quite shit with the effects, personally. I didn't think it was that good. So, so oh, this guy says, So rather than focus on the actor and what new talent she will bring to the table, the BBC would rather shoehorn in horribly unsubtle and smug glass ceiling metaphors. Therefore, reducing the actor to her base physical attribute rather than her talent. BBC is classy as ever, it seems. Glass ceiling. I did not catch that. I did not get that, because I, I, I don't really know what the glass ceil ceiling is exactly, but I've heard of it before. Do you know what the glass ceiling is? You don't. Surprising. Some people watching this would be like, what, you're a girl, you don't know what that is? I can't... I, I, I looked it up, like, a couple of years ago when I saw someone talk about it, and Never I didn't know what the fuck it was. But... If we quickly uh, go on the wiki, because I, I can't remember exactly what it is, but I know it's something to do with women. <coughs> so, 
An unacknowledged barrier to advancement in a profession, especially affecting women and members of minorities. So it's a, it's a metaphor used to represent an invisible barrier that keeps a given demographic. Okay, so it's not necessarily just women, but it's mainly, like, the, most people who talk about this are like, it's women. So, you know, the whole, oh, it's hard for a girl to get into this, this job because there's a glass ceiling. They got to break it. And what we just saw so there. that's why they did it. Yeah, that's fucking stupid. Oh, well, I'm a woman now. I'm the new doctor. I agree with people with the negative, like, no. Yeah, a lot of people actually don't like that glass ceiling reference. I think it's stupid. They probably thought it was really smart. Like, yeah, we got a woman here. Let's put her in a fucking big hall thing with an actual glass ceiling and she does something and it smashes. No. Please don't use this music in the actual series. Yeah, oh my god. If if Doctor Who suddenly has that sort of stuff in there, oh lord. Are you seeing these comments saying like the trailer, the release date trailer didn't even have the release date? Wait. It didn't? It didn't, did it? Oh, oh, oh. It's in the description. If, it, sure, if it wasn't on there. Surely it should be on there. It should have been on there. 7th of October. Oh, that's quite soon. Well, not that soon, but I mean, it's only next month. Yeah, <laughs> I get it, yeah. I just quite said what I said. Whoops correctly describes this video. Cringeworthy, unlikable. Yeah, I really no. You know what? I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to join the people who dislike this. Boom. I'm gonna. I. I. I rarely ever, like, dislike stuff. But. No, no, no. That was terrible. Like that, and that made me like even more like do not want to catch up with Doctor Who anytime soon. Like, mm. there's plenty of other stuff we need to watch. We've got. Um, a lot of the Marvel Netflix series to watch. We've got American Horror Story to watch. There's loads of other stuff. Walking Dead as well. I'd rather watch that stuff than a show that just hasn't... I haven't been enjoying for a few years. Yeah. A lot of people don't like this. Hmm. Well, anyway, uh, I don't. I don't really have anything to say. I was no. say on that. Like uh, again, disappointed. They definitely could have handled that a lot better. Um. Yeah, I don't know what to say to that. Closing thoughts. It's probably going to be shit. It is probably going to be shit, and you just wait until you see everybody say, "Oh, you don't like it just because it's a woman now." Mm. No. Doctor Who has been not that great for the last few years. I'm sure it's still not going to be that great. And, you know, the fact that the Doctor is now a woman, it doesn't even play into that. It's not going to be a thing. It's just genuinely... It's the stories. Generally. Hmm? It's the storylines. They're just crap. It's like they've run, they've run out. And don't even get me started on Clara. That's another fucking thing. Oh. I was fed up with her lord. I do not. Let's not even get into that. No, no. That, that's that's a, for a completely different yeah, video. Yeah, that's a whole other video. Anyway, we're going to stop now. And uh, I wonder what we're going to react to next. Who knows? <coughs> we'll have to... Who knows what the future holds? Anyway, <coughs> thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you guys in the next one where we hopefully react a little bit more positively. Yes. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.